Hi everyone, welcome to my first episode of Retro Vader. I know that YouTube is full of stuff about retro gaming, but here I would like to show you stuff I love and games I play. But first of all, I would like to send big fat loud thank you to Brandon, my Canadian friend from Instagram. Brandon is an artist who makes art from tiny squares and he did Retro Vader logo for me, which you could see at the beginning of this video. Check out his YouTube channel, I follow him since day one on Instagram and to be honest I'm a little jealous how talented he is and I admire his passion in doing pixel art. I love people who have this unbreakable passion to spend their time working on their hobby, getting better and better every day. Unfortunately I've got short span for stuff in my life and I've tried so many things but never stop with one for longer and dedicated my life for it. Maybe it's one way that's a good thing because I've tried so many things but on the other hand I've never excelled in anything to become as good as Brandon. Check his YouTube channel, I will drop a link to this channel below. It's full of great tutorials, pixel art and pixel animation. Once again, thank you mate, may the force be with you. And now it's time to present you my ultimate gaming machine, Death Starcade. <laughs> <laughs> it was built by my friend Krzysiek from Zielona Góra, Góra in Poland. I asked him a few months ago if he will be able and willing to build something like this for me and he obviously said yes. So we choose some graphics, we choose some theme and he did that beast for me. I keep that secret from my wife and from my son because I wanted to make make surprise and to see how shocked they will be to discover this beast waiting for them when they will come back to UK from Poland. And oh boy, they did. <laughs> when my wife sh saw it, she was shocked and uh, she told me that she never played it before. She never played arcade, which is uh, kind of surprising. In Leeds we got big arcade space uh, when you can go and pay for entry and then you can play or arcade for free but because of this covid shit is closed so we have to wait for reopening so that's why i've asked Krzysiek to build this for me and uh, that's why i've got it here now at home so we can play my favorite retro games this beast have around a thousand games from different consoles, arcade games, Sega, Nintendo, other stuff. Uh, I will be showing you them in my next episode. Just as an intro, just to give you a taste of it, I will show you one game which I found uh, when I was sipping whiskey with my friend and we were going through some games. But uh, to start with, I want to show you this loading screen. Uh, I've got four or five different types of loading screens. I can't actually skip them, so we have to watch them first uh, before we're gonna be able to choose any games. Let's have a watch. Star Wars, yeah. <laughs> Anyway, I love this kind of games because they bring some nostalgia. I am a dad, I'm a nerd who grew up too fast, so I'm trying to regain my childhood. <laughs> so this is loading screen, this is screen when you choose your games. They, they are divided by genre, fighting games, last played, favorites, all games as you can see. I didn't know this that this game existed. I never had Sega console in my life. I couldn't afford everything which I wanted to have <laughs> when I was a kid. So uh, most of stuff I bought myself when I came to England. That's not maybe the best game to show, but it's funny. <laughs> First of all, it's Michael Jackson. That special move, look. This special move is his dance with all enemies around him. The dying, but uh, you know, the dancing with him. So um, yeah, when we found that game with my friend, we were <laughs> amused so much. Just look, uh, Michael Jackson shot out of his hand. Uh, you've got this special move which I showed you before and I'll show you again. If you will catch that monkey, Michael becomes a robot. 
Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, leave some comment, hit notification button, uh, give me this motivation to create more content and to try to be better and better from episode to episode. Thank you very much for your support. I'm not gonna be showing you full gameplay because you can. I think, I'm sure you can find everything on YouTube now. But just wanna show you a few things which I like, which uh, make us giggle for gameplay. Look, you can charge your shot, and while you're doing this, Michael Jackson doing moonwalk. <laughs> I love it. Another, uh, another super move. I love the sound, I love the enemies dancing with Michael before they die. I will just show you this final boss on this of this stage and we're gonna finish. Uh, so we are a robot again. Uh, Michael Jackson got two special moves. One you saw it before and here we're gonna use uh, on this boss. Uh, he Exactly this one. Cross hat. Extra damage. So I love retro games because those days uh, graphic designers had to use more creativity having just small pixels to play with to come up with game, to uh, come up with art they really want. That's why I like uh, artwork of uh, Brandon, which I showed you before, and I love retro games. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave comment, thumbs up, and I hope I'm gonna see you next time. Bye! Yeah.